I don't know, have you ever taken pictures with a camera like this? Very similar, yeah. Yeah, with a shutter speed that you mm -hmm. can adjust the shutter speed. Well, what if you took it to your camera shop because you didn't think the shutter speed was accurate? Mm -hmm. They might use a gadget, something like this, to actually check it, and that's what you're going to do. First of all, okay. this is a counter that can count in thousandth of a second. Take that piece of paper out of the way so the light can go from there to there and okay. start the counter. Watch. Oh, it starts counting. And see, it's how it's starting, yes. And then you put it in and it stops again. And then it stops again. So push the reset button. Okay. And now I will set the camera, I've got the camera shutter set at a 60th of a second. Mm-hmm. So I'll put it in place like this. And you hit the reset button. Okay. And now I'll fire the shutter and see what we get. Decimal zero one six. Okay, hold it there now. Decimal zero one six. That's in thousandth of a second, yet the shutter mm -hmm. speed is in a sixtieth of a second. Can you transfer fractions to decimals? Yeah. How do you do what, that? What you do is you take the denominator and divide it into the numerator. Okay, in this case? Method. It would be one divided by sixty. What do you get? Equals zero decimal zero one seven. So it's pretty close. Yes. So the camera is probably working pretty well mm -hmm. at a sixtieth of a second. Okay, I'm going to take the camera out of the way because I now have another test. Put the cardboard in place. Here, okay. take the cardboard and I'll set the reset button. And now see how fast you are. Well, pretty slow by cameras. Yeah. Faster than the 60 of a second. Try. That see was if you better. can improve it. Ah, there you're getting a little better. Yeah. Anyway, you see now how a very high speed counter can not only check shutter speed, but check your reaction time too.